Hi kids! We're so glad you've joined us again for another science experiment. Today's experiment has to do with density. You're going to need a few things. Uh, first, one egg. And be sure to take it out of the refrigerator at least 30 minutes before you do this because you want it at room temperature. Also, you're going to need some water, measuring cups, a large bowl, half a cup of table salt, there, uh, three cups, and a spoon to transfer the eggs between cups and to stir things up. Into the large bowl, pour one and a half cups of water. You'll add your salt and stir it up. While Molly continues to stir, we're going to add another cup of water to our bowl and keep stirring until it's all dissolved. This might take a few minutes. Fill the first cup with regular old water. The next step is to gently place the egg into the cup. And what happened? It just sinks. Sinks straight to the bottom. We're going to fill this cup with the salt water solution we made. Now we're going to use our spoon to transfer the egg from the plain water to the salt water. Okay. Now let's see what happens. What happened? It's loading. Very carefully, I'm going to pour this cup about halfway with the salt water. That's good. And we'll put the egg in. Okay. Let's see what happens. It floats. Flow. So now what happens when we start to add regular old water? And what happened? It stays in the middle. Right, it floated but only about halfway. So the egg floated or sunk based on the density of the solution. So this week, Pastor Chris and Scripture teach us about why people respected Jesus in his day. And it was often because he did not just speak with authority, but more importantly, he led by his actions, showing us all how performing good works based on his teachings can lead to good things. In our experiment, each molecule of salt led to a greater density of salt in the solution. And with the increasing density, the salt, the egg was lifted further up. Likewise, with each good act we perform, the density of good acts in the world increases and we are all lifted up. We can be good leaders like Jesus, showing everyone around us how we can lift each other up. So, how can you lead by example this week and lift up those around you? Think about it, talk about it with your family, and as always, We'll see you next week. I'm playing with it.